I'm here with Tassie Reed from Black Sheep. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm a little nervous because you're kind of a mogul. <laughs> you have like an empire of ice cream et al that we're going to discuss, mm -hmm. but I'm here to talk to you a little bit about your background at La Pietra. Okay. Because you're a La Pietra graduate, yes? Class of 2014. Let's talk about the independent projects because that's really a cornerstone mm -hmm. of the entrepreneurial spirit that they foster at La Pietra. Mm -hmm. So talk to me about the independent program that they have there. Yeah, so my junior year, we are tasked to take on a project and complete it throughout the whole year, whatever you want, it's pretty open-ended. Um, just make sure you learn something and you challenge yourself. Um, so I wanted to start my own business um, because I always, that's something I was always interested in. So I decided to start my own online swimwear business. Hmm. Um, and I learned a lot from it. Um, I learned how to work hard for what I wanted. Um, so I learned a lot throughout that year. And did you make money off of that business? I did, <laughs> yeah. So that's why I continued. So I'm assuming I you passed it. that class with flying colors, that uh, project. Yeah, it was, it was good. So what do you think you learned at La Pietra? Well, La Pietra really helped my confidence. I've always been really shy and timid, and uh, they really helped support me uh, and whatever my goals were. So, you know, I think it was a really ambitious thing to do for my independent project, but they supported me in doing that. Um, and I never pictured myself being able to speak up and like, like do interviews like this or like, or like lead a staff. But when I look back at it, I, I think it's because of Lafayette Church, it's because I wasn't afraid to speak up in the classroom and, and do all that. So when you, how do you make the jump from online swimwear mm -hmm. to ice cream? How does that happen? Well, they're both just things that I'm passionate about. Mm -hmm. So the reason why I did swimwear in the first place was because it's something that I knew, it's something that I liked, it's something that I thought that I could bring and make it my own, and same with ice cream. So it's something that I felt like there was a need for in Hawaii, like good homemade ice cream, mm -hmm. and it's something that I love. So, yeah. <laughs> Thousands of people ask this question, but why black sheep? Like, where did that come from for the name? No, yeah, so it's because we wanted to be different from everyone else. We wanted to be the black sheep. Oh, yeah. rebels. Yeah. Rebels Do with the cause. Only. Yep. Nice. And so is that the theory behind all of the ice cream flavors that you make? Is like, what everybody else is doing, we'll go that way. Yeah, exactly. I want to make things, I want to make different, unique flavors and my own spin on things. Nice. Okay, well, I think I'm going to have to taste some of this ice cream because I've been away for a long time. I, don't, I haven't been able to taste it yet. So yeah, of course. Don't go anywhere. When we come back, I'm going to taste tons of black sheep ice cream. <laughs> like tons. We're back with ice cream. <laughs> what am I? What's this one, Tassie? What's this so one? you've got cookie cookie. It's homemade cookie butter. Oh, okay. And I have sugar sugar. It's got pecan brittle. Homemade yeah. pecan brittle because it's all homemade. Oh, wow. Yep, that's cookie butter. You are so talented. Thank you, thank you La Pietra, for making you so talented. <laughs> I just want to thank everybody. It's been the Food & Wine Show. So we've had Denise Yamaguchi on the show. Thank you to Denise. MW Restaurant Toast with Inspiration Interiors. And of course you, Tossi, for being a mogul. We're new best friends, and I'm going to come here all the time. Perfect. Come check you guys out in Wahiwa here or at Kauka Boulevard. Yeah near the Costco. Ice cream's great at either one of the locations. Um, this is so good. <laughs> I have to try all the other flavors though. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll see you next week.